So vim normal mode commands actually have a pattern. And if you remember this pattern, it's gonna be a lot easier to use the commands rather than memorizing all the combinations. First of all, you got a count, then you got the operation, and then you got the motion. So if you use, for example, dw, this is gonna mean delete word, one word, because I didn't put in a count. You can also do two dw, and it'll delete two words. If I do d around and then quotation, it's going to delete the quotation and its contents because it's around. I can use di, which is inside, delete inside quotation. It's going to delete the contents but not the surrounding quotation. And of course, you can use something else instead of quotation. It's going to work. So you can see the pattern here. Delete is the operation. In the same way, I can use c, which is change. So change around quotation. It's going to do the same thing but put me in insert mode. Another handy thing is visual mode, so you can do V around quotation, and then you can see what is marked before you do an operation. Now I can just run an operation, for example, delete D. And you can see the pattern here. I did a video folding HTML tags, my previous video. So that was ZF, which is fold, and then around and tag. So you can see the pattern here as well. ZF is for fold, around tag is the motion, in the same way, I can do D around and then tag. It's going to delete instead of folding. And that's it. Thanks for watching.